Hi, welcome back to the Swim Doctor's Office. Alright, today I'm going to be going over some motivation for you guys. Now before we get into it, go ahead and like the video, subscribe to the channel for more videos, and maybe even put a comment down there Let me know if you're new or uh, what else you would like to see in the videos. All right, the number one thing I tell all of my clients is not to work too hard. Like I say with all my videos, don't move on until you feel confident and comfortable with what you're working on currently. Um, you don't want to be working on too many things at the same time, and I've covered this in a lot of my other videos, but I'm gonna bring it up again. Your brain can't work on too many things at the same time. So break it into parts, do floating first, do kicking, then do arms, and then lastly do the breathing. Very last thing you do is work on the breathing. The reason why is because your body needs to breathe, obviously, and if you're not getting in any air, your body's gonna tense up, it's gonna freak out, and you're gonna do anything you can to be able to breathe. That's why I say relax and take your time take lots of rest breaks. Um, you're, this is new for your body and you're gonna get exhausted very fast. Even if you're a seasoned veteran with swimming, um, if you're learning something new with swimming, take rests. That way you can recharge your brain and you can recharge your body. That's why we work on breathing last. Now, if you seem stuck, work on something else. Um, just always keep trying to progress. If something isn't progressing, um, you might wanna just give it a little bit more time. I'm pretty sure I've said this before, but you wanna be working on, if this is brand new to you, or if you're learning a brand new stroke, brand new thing, anything, work on it three times a week. That way, you don't forget it along the week. I have had a lot of clients who, um, they come in once a week and I teach them swimming and it takes them a very long time to learn. Now, obviously that that's not everybody. Some people are just naturally good at that kind of stuff and they just do it once a week. But for the most part, do it three times a week, that way you can get the most out of it and you can learn faster. Okay, don't forget to like and subscribe and keep coming back to some doctor's office for more cures.